The witch wound is a spiritual wound that often manifests as a fear of standing out, being authentically seen, and speaking your truth, especially as it relates to spirituality and magic. The witch wound can also show up as feeling like you are too much or not enough for society, feeling like your spiritual gifts, your intuition, your emotions are invalid, that you need to suppress them in order to fit in, or even to be safe. It can also appear as a feminine wound, such as feeling unsafe around other women and not knowing why, or as ancestral or past life memories. You might experience certain somatic sensations in your throat or in your chest, or have a visceral reaction to feeling tight things around your neck or water in your face and not knowing where these memories are coming from. What do all of these vague symptoms have in common? They all link back to the witch trials. Between the 15th and 18th centuries, an estimated 50,000 people were executed in Europe, 80% of them women, under the suspicion of practicing witchcraft. Many of the factors that played a role in inciting the witch hunts patriarchy, colonialism, capitalism, religious intolerance, are still very much present in our society today, which is why the witch wound lives on. My book, Heal the Witch Wound, follows these various threads through past, present, and future, exploring the history and symptoms of the witch wound in depth, but even more importantly, offering healing guidance in the form of both magical and mundane practices, such as rituals, spell work, journal prompts, and visualization prompts to help you on your path of healing the witch wound.